Welcome to Space Center Houston, a world-renowned science and space learning center just 25 miles southeast of downtown Houston. Imagine yourself tracing a line from the heart of the city, passing under wide decks of skies down to the NASA Parkway. As you approach the entrance, you'll see the towering white and blue Independence Plaza shuttle replica. It's your first clue that what's inside is no ordinary museum. Space Center Houston is the official visitor center of NASA's Johnson Space Center, where real mission control teams have made history. It's more than just a museum, it's a living, breathing story of human exploration. Every hallway echoes with their collective dreams of the stars. And whether you're here on a school field trip, a family vacation, or just feeding your curiosity, there's something here to spark your imagination. As you step into the main exhibit halls, you're greeted by life-sized astronaut suits, detailed spacecraft replicas, and real pieces of history. In the Astronaut Gallery, you can compare different suits used across decades of exploration. The materials, designs, and technologies have all evolved, and here you can see, and sometimes even feel, that evolution for yourself. One of the highlights of the Lunar Module Trainer is the very simulator astronauts once used to practice landing on the moon. It's massive and detailed, exactly what NASA engineers used to get Apollo crews ready for the unknown. Kids love the Mission Briefing Center where they can ask questions, join mini-experiments, and learn how gravity, oxygen, and pressure work differently in space. There are touchscreen panels everywhere with short animated explanations that even adults will find fascinating. Whether you're 6 or 60, this place makes science feel alive, and it makes space feel possible. For those who like to learn by doing, Space Center Houston shines even brighter. Head to the Mars exhibit where you can operate a mock Mars rover over rugged terrain. Try your hand at docking spacecraft in the simulation pods or practice what it feels like to pick up objects with clumsy astronaut gloves. There's also the Apollo 17 command module, splashed with aware of actual re-entry and moon rocks collected from Apollo missions.
Yes, actual moon rocks. You can even touch one. Smoothed over by millions of hands before yours, yet still alien to Earth. Every placard, screen, and interactive display is there to help you understand what it took and still takes to venture into space. Step outside for one of the center's most iconic photo ops, the Independence Plaza. It's the only exhibit like this in the world. And yes, you can go inside both the plane and the shuttle. Inside the 747, you'll see how engineers modify the aircraft to carry the weight and balance of a spacecraft. Climb into the shuttle replica and you'll find recreations of the cockpit and mid-deck living space. It's surprisingly tight and filled with switches, screens, and panels. The walls are lined with history, photos, diagrams, and videos of shuttle launches and carrier flights. You get the stand where astronauts trained, sat, and launched into orbit. It's not just a static display, it's a window into an era of reusable space flight that shaped NASA's legacy for decades. Walk a bit further and you'll find the Skylab trainer. This mock-up of America's first space station is so large that you can walk through its living quarters. It gives you a real sense of how cramped and yet amazing life in orbit can be. Space Center Houston is more than a collection of exhibits. It's a journey through time, science, and ambition. You feel the weight of human curiosity in every corridor. You understand what it took and what it still takes to go beyond our world. But this is only the beginning. In our next episode, we're taking you to Rocket Park, home to one of the last remaining Saturn V rockets. It's where engineering scale meets raw power and where you realize just how massive our ambitions really are. Before we wrap up, I want to hear from you. What's your favorite memory of NASA? Was it the space shuttle launch on TV, a school project on the moon, or maybe a model rocket you built as a kid? Share your stories. We're all connected by the wonder of space. And if you thought today was amazing, wait until you see what's waiting at Rocket Park. Stay curious. Stay tuned and thanks for watching.